everybody, Paul here at Dream Guitars, and man, this thing is fun. This is a Big Pink by Steve Klein and Steve Kaufman. Um, so Klein Guitars, designed by Steve Klein and played for years by the likes of Joni Mitchell and so many others. And then Steve Kaufman has been building them in recent years, um, but true to Steve's design. So um, just love them. We, we've been a dealer for them for a while now and just great to work with. And they build stuff like this that's just, you know, makes you feel like a little kid again. You know, this thing is big and powerful and clear and beautiful and just can cover a lot of territory. And it's got some really unique features on it we're going to check out. So first and foremost, you've got a beautiful Bear Claw Sitka top. I'm a big fan of Sitka. Sitka, um, a lot of people, um, you know, think that because it's included on a lot of guitars that it's, you know, average wood, but it's not at all. Sitka is an incredible wood. And especially when you can find pieces like this. And what I like about it is tonally, it has everything. Sitka is powerful. You can hit it hard. It's got warmth and overtones, and it's also got a lot of clarity. So it's sort of a great wood um, to sort of do everything as far as a spruce goes. Um, this guitar, as you might notice, has crooked frets or multi-scale. So we've got a longer bass strings and shorter trebles. Um, something I'm a big champion of. I'm sure you've heard me talk about it, but it gives you the ability to play in lots of tunings in addition to standard. So I'm playing in standard today, so it works perfect there. But if you want to go down to dad gad or C tunings, this will absolutely do it. You've got a little bit of a hint of the beauty of the wood here. This is pink ivory for the bridge, and pink ivory is, of course, what we're going to see in a moment. Um, very rare wood. It's it's a hardwood. It's um, has a, a sound that a lot of people say that it has the qualities of Brazilian rosewood. Um, I definitely hear that in as far as the clarity and also the warmth and beauty in it, and it's very powerful. Um, I love the shape of the climb bridge. Always have. It seems to really transfer the energy to the top. They use a, a pin style on the back so the ball ends of the string sit onto pins that are permanently fixed in the bridge and just come up and over the saddle. So it's a really nice, simple setup, very easy to change strings. Um, the fingerboard itself, also pink ivory. You've got a full abalone top border and there's a clear pick guard on this one. Then you've got the um, pink ivory on the headstock as well with a complete um, rose inlaid. It's really pretty nice touch there. The back plate is also pink ivory over a highly figured maple neck. I really love that. And then maple bindings around this bad boy, the beautiful pink ivory. Um, really nice colors. It's a, it's a very cool wood. And it's uh, it, over the years, like 10 years from now, it might darken a little bit and get a little bit more of a deeper hue to it. Um, but it stays very beautiful. And then the other thing about Klein Guitars, just a side note, they, he always puts a trap door in, on the end here, which is really helpful for any kind of repair you might ever need to do or adjustment, putting in a pickup system. Um, I think in part, they probably use it when the guitar is completed and built, they can go in and still tweak the voicing a little bit to get every little ounce of sound out as well. So this one's a powerhouse. This is great for somebody who wants a strummer or a finger style guitar that will just fill the room. Absolutely. So I'm going to have some fun today. Let's check out the Klein Big Pink. <music> Good clean fun. <laughs> 